Welcome back to another exciting episode. Today we're going to be talking about robots. It's not AI, but it's freaking amazing. Let's get started. So, Unitree, uh, mostly known for releasing these uh, horrifyingly uh, cool robotic dogs, has decided that they would like to uh, dive into the world of humanoids. They already have one that you could buy for around $150,000, but they released the, the G1 today. And as you can see here, it is priced around $16,000. The G1 is around a four foot uh, humanoid uh, a agent, AI avatar, if you would, and weighs around 100 pounds. And um, so let's watch a couple of these little unnerving videos of it. There's nothing weird about this at all. That's how it folds itself so it can be picked up. This is how it gets itself up off the ground. Nothing like a good old back stretch. Um, it has the hand movements will be lifelike and you can manipulate it to do very precise uh, movements with it. And for example, um, if you wanted to crush a walnut or, you know, <laughs> pop the top off of a uh, Coca Cola bottle, it can flip burgers and all that fun stuff and do some soldering. Uh, this thing here is pros most likely going to uh, take over factories. I, I hate to say it, but this you will see a lot of these in factories. Um, and especially around that price. If, of course, that's the price from video uh, price. But So it could be, you know, when you add some options, it could be more expensive. They put out an actual demo video. Let's take a, just a watch of it. It shows some of that, but it also shows some of its other capabilities. <laughs> Okay, so what do you guys think? Uh, can really do some really awesome stuff. Um, the <laughs> the popping the top off the coke was kind of neat. Uh, one thing I did notice though, and I'm a little confused about. Um, let's see here. On this one, he has uh, gloves on. And uh, it doesn't look like he has the same hands as the other one. So I'm not sure if that's an option that that's going to be uh, different style hands. Although you would think the uh, having uh, five digits would be... Uh, more precise than just three okay and then um this guy's you know kind of a jerk look at the look on his face man he hates that robot um and then okay that's just super super weird um and then yeah so oh and then this right here um Well, I think it's where it's starting to... Yeah. Right here. Okay, so it says uh, Unitree Robot Unified Large Model. So I guess they're going to have different sizes. But right now on the website, they just have... I think they just have one. So let's actually exit out of here. And then... I think... Oh, yeah, you can buy it up here. Okay. So... 
do, 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 human. So here's the hundred fifty thousand dollar one, uh, and then this one right here is the one that's going to be. I feel like. Wait a minute. Oh, I guess you can't, or maybe it doesn't have the buying options on it yet. Um, here's the specs on it. You know, it's got the it shows on here just three fingers. Okay, optional installation of tactical sensor arrays. That's uh, okay. Um, total degrees of freedom is 43. It has uh, in-depth camera and it lasts about two hours. Uh, and it's got um, extra large quick battery release battery, hollow joint wiring with the whole machine. Um, mobility speed, I guess that's uh, two miles a second. No, no, that's not right. I don't know. I don't understand mobility speed there. I saw it. I never said I was a smart man, but I know what love is. All right. So here's the you know the details on it. Um, and price does uh, exclude uh, shipping and uh, uh, sales tax. So are you gonna buy one? Do you work at a factory? Do you think this thing's gonna take your job? Um, I would buy one just to mow my yard and maybe do some stuff around the house, I guess, that I would want to do. What do you guys think? You tell me. I just wanted to share it with you, and uh, thanks for watching.